Oh, Kako, it's Pastor Keith from Christ Lutheran Church here in Mililani Town. You know where to find me. Some of you have found us. It's great. And uh, it's morning prayer for September 23rd, 2024. Where has the time gone? Oh, oh well. This is Psalm 139, selected verses. And it's, it's a, really, it's a prayer for individual guidance. And first God is the outsider, and then God seems to be the, the insider, the spirit within me, moving me. So, hear these words. O Lord, you have searched me and known me. You know when I sit down and when I rise up. You discern my thoughts from far away. You reach out my path and my lying down and are acquainted with all my ways. Even before a word is on my tongue, O Lord, you know it completely. You hem me in behind and before and lay your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me. It is so high I cannot retain it. Where can I go from your spirit? Or where can I flee from your presence? If I ascend to heaven, you are there. If I make my bed in Sha'ol, you are there. If I take the wings of the morning and settle at the farthest limits of the sea, even there your hand shall lead me and your right hand shall hold me fast. If I say, surely the darkness shall cover me and the light around me become night, even the darkness is not dark to you. The night is bright as the day, for darkness is as light to you. For it was you who formed my inward parts. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you, for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Wonderful are your works that I know very well. My frame was not hidden from you. When I was being made in secret, intricate, woven in the depths of the earth, your eyes beheld my unformed substance. In your book were written all the days that were formed for me, when none of them as yet existed. How weighty to me are your thoughts, O God! How vast is the sum of them! I try to count them. They are more than the sand. I come to the end. I am still with you. Search me, O God, and know my heart. Test me and know my thoughts. See if there is any wicked way in me, and lead me in the way of everlasting. Lead me in the way of everlasting. That's kind of moving. Yeah, how weighty to me are your thoughts, O God. That's a psalm worth sitting down and pondering. So I invite you to do that. Listen to it again or open your, your Bible and read it. I, I left out the part about that was a little violent, but um, check it out. Psalm 139, 1 to 18 and 23 and 24. Epule kako. Let us pray. Almighty God. Creator of the universe, we are filled with wonder at all your works and overwhelmed by your infinite wisdom. We praise you for your majesty. Yet even more, we rejoice that you do not forget us, yet desire to know and care for us more and more. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. Good to have you with us. I'm always curious how you found us, so if, uh, if you get a chance, uh, let me know or stop by on a Sunday morning and say hi and we'll uh, sing and pray and read scripture and reflect on the word and, of course, have some bread and wine, the body and the blood. So, may the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look upon you with favor and grant you peace. Amen.